So you may have your Android phone, whether it's a Samsung Galaxy, or whether it's a OnePlus or a Google Pixel, and you might be seeing that your phone is overheating like crazy all the time. Now, I experience this every, almost every single day with a lot of my different Samsung phones and different you know, Android phones that I own. And the very first thing I would recommend doing as always is to make sure you aren't actually on a super outdated version of your Android software. So typically with a lot of Android manufacturers, what they do is that a lot of the carriers push out their updates. If you have a phone like a Google Pixel, you probably have an update available. But what I would recommend doing is just making your way over to your settings application like this. And you may even get a little pop-up at the very top telling you that a software update is available. And those are usually really good signs that you're probably good to go in terms of the you know, overheating that you're having. So what I would recommend doing is just going down, finding your software update panel. So here we have it right here and just downloading and installing that latest update. Every single time I've went through and installed the latest update for the most part, it ends up fixing a lot of different issues. It may not fix your overheating in and of itself, but it's still one of those things you can do to pretty much alleviate a lot of the different issues that you're going to have on your specific phone. So in that specific point, I would recommend updating your device and that could very well end up fixing the problems you're having as well. Now, on top of that, there's a lot of applications in the background that suck up a lot of data and not just a lot of memory in general. So if you're okay with kind of shutting off and for stopping some applications, well, what I would recommend doing is going to your specific phone right here, going into your application manager. So find your little apps panel right here and pretty much go through all these applications and find the ones that you're pretty much no longer using or you're no longer you know, even caring about. You can delete them, which would probably be the better thing to do. Or what you could do is pretty much go through and just force stop these applications. So you can go into Bofa like this, for example, and I can go and click force stop, which is down here. Now it's not going to delete this application. It's not going to be doing anything. All it's going to be doing is pretty much stopping and preventing it from using data and storage, or just basically using memory in the background. So by doing this to all these apps, you can pretty much clean out essentially the background of your phone and it will actually help your device in the long run. So I can click force stop here. I can force stop it there. And that's another thing I can do. And that's honestly something I would highly, highly recommend doing. So ultimately on top of that, like I mentioned before, you can delete these applications as well. So just delete these apps and the ones you're no longer using. That's another thing you could try. You can also try if you can delete any of the pre-installed applications. So if you're using a lot of apps in the background that are pre-installed with your device, if you're able to delete some, I'd recommend doing that too. If you're calling people in the background and you're doing things like that, video calling while you're playing a game or something, that can also cause some overheating. There's not really a fix for that. Maybe to pick one or the other in that specific example. But those are a few different ways you can go ahead and pretty much stop your Android phone from overheating. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.